This is my daughter, and uh, she is just really great at having fun. She just knows how but to she have fun. She has a degree in she having has a degree fun. What is your actual degree, <laughs> Yes, though? my actual degree is youth and family recreation. So not is it just a degree in fun, but it's a degree in family fun. <laughs> and with everything I've learned and everything that I've researched, i found that the most important thing really is that families need to spend time together. And it needs to be simple and easy, because when it comes more complex, it just doesn't happen because life is already as complex Can as I we add need one it. Can thing? Inexpensive? Please do. <laughs> and inexpensive. Which That's brings us to today's activity. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Everyone has partnerless socks, let's be honest. It's, you know, you fun. put them in the dryer and they go in as two, they come out as one. We don't know how it happens, but it happens. It's a secret so of the universe. It is one of those it secrets is, of yeah. the universe. <laughs> so one of the great things that you can do with those lovely socks is make sock puppets. You know, you hear those dreaded words in the summer, you hear, mom, I'm bored, or dad, what should we do? No one wants to hear that. All right, I want to Whip going. out some socks and just find random things around your house, because we're all about easy, right? Find pieces of fabric that you can cut into eyes or noses or pom-poms that you can get. Just really anything. Yarn. Yarn can become hair, smiles. I mean, the best part of it is just find the most random thing you can and give it to the kids and say, go. <laughs> because kids, we tell them to draw the leaves green and the flowers red and the flowers orange. And we don't give them the opportunity to just create and have fun. So this is a fun opportunity. Here's one that I made, I made a my mother puppet. made. I, I'm I, really simple. <laughs> uh, I did this one really quick last night just to kind of show some easy. So there's and here's eyes another and there's one. hair. There's a little mouth. Right, um, but it's, it's all about one. simple. This is Missy. Missy the sock <laughs> Can you see the resemblance? <laughs> <laughs> okay, yes, that's, that's But it's all good. about fun and easy. So that's one great, great sock um, activity. Here's, here's another one that looks like you made but buttons. You can use buttons. Anything you can find around the house so while you guys is perfect. are working on that, we are going to use another sock. sock. Missy, I don't is know if you were watching sock? earlier, but I actually uh, made this. Oh, yes. did you? Is that, you know that very talented <laughs> as well? I don't know well. if you know that. just and thought I'd throw that in. Apart. Well, I'm, yeah. I'm very impressed. <laughs> So you guys work on that. Maybe we can get yes. some close-ups we'll of see. your socks. And one of the things and you can do is, oh, and look, we've got um, yep. fabric, uh, what are these called? Sparkles? Gl glitter, sparkle, pen. Puff, puffy paint. Puffy paint, thank you. Uh -huh. Markers, glue. we've got Here's markers, fabric, glue. glue. Course, so you can just be so creative. You can use um, pipe cleaners. And if you wanted to, you can just string it through and make antennas. So, I mean, it's just it's just fun. But the funnest thing is let the kids the do kids it. And before you know it, you'll have a dinosaur okay. or something fun like that. And while they're working on that, we're going to make one of those rice bags hold that you up. can. Hold ah, on, hold oh, on. wait, that's oh, right. We yeah. got a phone. I made this for a reason. <laughs> 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 what am I thinking? Yeah, I did not spend all that time cutting this. Right. Okay, what now, are we making here? So Explain this. We got the funnel, we got a saw. I need to know. We. On my little. Man. We are making one of those rice bags <laughs> that you can heat in the microwave or cool in the freezer, and then you can put it around your neck and make you feel good and you all. You know, I have another stuff. idea for the socks that I used to do when I was a kid. Sure. You know, we were we were poor, but my dog liked chewing on things, and so my mom took you know the loner socks, and mm -hmm. she would put an, more socks in them. So take one sock, you put a whole bunch of socks in, you tie a knot, and then you can throw it around the house, and it, it can be a dog chewy toy. You know oh, what? That's a great we, called it, we called it a wingy dingy. That brings me to a cute little story about my upbringing in Canada. <laughs> now, we have taken some rice and put it in here to make for one of those things to heat up. My dad, as a disciplinary tool, would actually fill these with finishing nails. <laughs> That explains a lot. Oh, okay, I need, yes, I would like to put that. <laughs> yes, That's here's some fabric shooter. glue. And if you want, you can use glue, you but then you have to have kids that are patient enough to wait for the glue to dry. Uh, one thing I did is I sewed these on, and it was really, really easy. It doesn't need to look <laughs> cute if you don't have sewing skills like me. Um, and another re, oh, that's cute. Very cute. Oh. Just glue <laughs> that star on there with just fabric glue. It's all the talents that we have. It's that's amazing. right, that's right. Um, but another really, really fun sock activity for the whole family to participate in is what we lovingly refer to as the sock wars. Oh, yes. And growing up, we would always get all these leftover socks just like this. And I'm just going to leave the puppet on for the rest of the time if we're okay with that. Why not? Don't check. Um, you like know, all these leftover kids. socks, you know, they get holes in them. They're just not quite the same anymore. And so, you know, you have these, all these leftover socks. They don't have a pair, as we already discussed. So, yeah, we'll one of the things you do is we yeah. give everyone their missing socks. And everyone gets a basket, goes around the house, hides behind a couch or a chair or something to that effect. And when everyone says go, we all start throwing. So ah! <laughs> Like this. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. For those of you who don't suck war. <laughs> yeah, can we get security? Can we get security down to the home That's team set, right. please? <laughs> what in the name of everything that is good and right just happened? <laughs> I, had I knew it was coming, and I still don't. Okay, jumped. I'm 20 pounds overweight. I didn't need a shot to the ticker like that. Oh, my gosh. There was something going on. I Who is that guy? That's Skyler. That's another one of my children. That's my son, Skyler.